my job on Blue Ghost is I'm the only welder for Blue Ghost. So all the plumbing, everything that's been welded on Blue Ghost, I welded that. So from the very first component panel all the way up to final tie-in welds on the main engine, those are all my welds. I really like writing weld schedules. So I um, want you to imagine playing chess in the dark. You can't see the board, but you have to make your first five moves and then someone turns the light on. Because you can't see what the weld's doing. You can't make any adjustments while it's doing it. So you have to plan everything five moves ahead and then see, what, see where you land from there. Usually by six months into that, you kind of know where you're gonna land. So you're kind of blindly jumping, but not blindly jumping. What you do is you're gonna plan the, the voltage drop per level per percentage of that pipe. You're cutting the pipe into 360, you're gonna cut it into fours or fives. Each level is gonna be a different amperage and you're gonna raise or lower it depending on how much heat you wanna bring all the way around. So you have to keep that bead the same width the whole way around the tube while lowering your amperage so you don't burn the tube up. And you can't manually do it while it's welding it, you just have to know how to do it before you weld it. This, this career field is amazing. The things you're gonna weld on, welding something that's gonna go into space, welding a rocket that's gonna launch, you know, it's, it's crazy to really think about when it hits you, like, oh man. But welding spacecraft, never boring. Never is it boring. My name is James Holster, and we're going to the moon.